Looking ahead on Arts Avenue Skylight Music Theater, 64th season begins later this week. Joining me live in studio is the theater's artistic director, Michael Unger, and executive director, Susan Varela. Thank you both so much for coming in this morning. Good morning. It's so great to be here. Yes. Yeah, so very big, exciting next couple of days. Season opens up on Friday the 13th. It does indeed. Yes. Lucky Friday the 13th. Yes. That's right. I like to think of it that way. Lucky Friday the 13th. So what can folks expect for the 64th season? Well, we have five phenomenal shows, again, uh, opening with Candide, which is a Leonard Bernstein masterpiece written by Voltaire in the 18th century about a young man and a woman who grow up in a world that's probably too optimistic for its own good. But this production is not your powdered wig version of Candide. It is by a visionary director and designer and the Broadway top puppeteer and uh, on Broadway, whose name is James Ortiz. Mm -hmm. And we have massive puppets that represent some of the larger than life characters, and it's a very small cast and a very intimate production that is so creative and so fun. It's set in like a leave it to be for 50s. <laughs> it's like no candy you've seen before. Mm -hmm. And the music is so glorious, the overture alone, glitter and be gay, the finale, make a garden grow. Just music that you cannot get enough of. It's so fabulous. I love that. Some of the music, I think, people will recognize without even knowing that it's from Candide. Really? Yes. The overture is iconic and is used for different advertising, and it is the theme song of PBS Great Performances for years. So I think people are going to hear it and say, oh, I know that tune, and I didn't even know it was from Candide. I love that. And so what do you think about Skylight's productions that make it so unique that 64 seasons have been around, and it seems to be continuing with such great success? Well, we're so proud of the season that we have right now, and uh, part of what we think makes Skylight special is the space we're in, the Cabot Theater. It's such an intimate theater experience, and so people come to see our shows not to see perhaps that sp particular title, but they think, what is Skylight going to do with that title? So we, we always give you a, an intimate, um, special experience with every show. Definitely. Candide is a great case in point for this. Well, yeah. It's a very unique production that is custom orchestrated for Skylight, custom cast, custom designed by this very visionary director, and it's so fun. I love that. And I know this was originally supposed to open up in 2020, right? That's right. It was, yeah. Yes, yeah. it was supposed to end our 2019-2020 season. Okay. And because of the pandemic, we had the pandemic had other plans. Yes. <laughs> so some of these actors have been waiting for three years. Wow. They were cast in 2019, and they've been waiting all this time to finally get on stage. And Friday, they get to do that. And their yeah. audiences as well. Yes, so the audience has been waiting. Finally on the stage. Well, it seems like good luck October the 13th, Friday the 13th, I think so. to finally yeah. unveil this to the public so I think that's going to be great. Where can people purchase their tickets or keep up to date with the calendar of shows that are coming up? You can go to skylightmusictheater.org is it the best place to do it or you can call our box office 414-278-27. Oh, <laughs> go to the oh, website. Yes, yes, don't worry. We'll make sure we get <laughs> all but the information correct. -E <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> all right. Well, best of luck. Thank I think you. it's going to be a great season and it seems like people cannot wait to come out this Friday again. Tickets still available, correct? Yes, yes they are. Perfect. But they're going fast. Yes. So. Make sure to get them now. All right, folks, October the 13th through the 29th, this is kicking off the first production of Skylight Theater's 64th season. You can find a link to tickets and more information up on the 12 News app right now.